delivering hay up to the ewes. And the cattle are all restless. Look at them over there. In the... I think the neighbors just let loose a whole bunch of heifers out in the fields. So they're galloping across one field to go and meet another herd, the neighboring farmer's herd. So it's, see, I have two farmers here. One farmer owns land there, and the other farmer owns land there. So, releasing of cattle, they all got to meet their new neighbors. So, I'm now putting hay in. You can see the yews are already munching my fresh hay bales, as are the lambs. Some of them are, not all of them are. A lot of them are out in the orchard. Enjoying the spectacle of heifer cows galloping around a neighboring field. So I've got this one more bale to spread in this hay rack. And then the sheep will have three locations for hay in the coming storm. They'll be able to be here, where a little bit is, They'll be here and then in the place in the garden, the lean-to in the garden. I have the baling fine here so that I don't hit my head because these beams are so low. You can see they're all hanging down there. So when I see these, I know to duck my head so I don't crack my skull, which has happened a few too many times. So yeah, the quads of interest. Hello, sweetie. How are you? Yes. It's a very interesting quad, isn't it? it? Smells different. You're not used to it. Hopefully nobody's going to stomp on somebody's tail. He's having a lovely time eating pre-cooked vegetables. Ooh. Yeah, be nice. Be nice. Good girl. Oh, don't get your head stuck in that. I always have baling twine available. Baling twine is a farmer's best friend. Oh. Top knots shifted. She wolf out of the way. How are you, sweetie? Yes. You're such a good girl. You're such a good girl. Yeah. Where's your mama? The cattle are all bellowing away still at each other. All the excitement at meeting new neighbors. Look at them all munching away at the hay. Okay, I've got to finish the job at hand. That bale has to go in there now. <laughs> Be nice. <laughs>